is Sims, and we are back with more Sweet Views, and we are going to get uh, Mayoshi's bad ending. So we are supposed to go into the diary. Um, we gotta go to... Uh, no. Wait, what? Oh, there he is. I skipped by it too fast. Okay. We want to go here. Affection isn't sufficient. Okay. And we want to make sure it's zero. Okay. Yeah. If you won't be able to raise the affection level of other characters. Okay. Okay. No. Oops. Okay, that's what. Ugh, I forgot how to. When I was supposed. To, how the fuck I was supposed to do that? Do you want the same name? Of course I want Spacey. 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 All right. So. Oh, yeah, I forgot you. These <laughs> just stay there until you click. Not smart. Okay. So we'll skip through everything. And we basically change all of our answers. Aside from the explosive insight, so. All right, so. We're just skipping all through. I I don't know what to say. After after a long silence, Kota finally seemed to calm himself down. Sorry, I just mm, forget about that, okay? Do the opposite. Well, we get to get mad at the bear, at the pig. At the bear, at the pig. I wiped a few tears away from my eyes and put my hand on his shoulder. And that must have been so hard uh, to live with that for so long. The words felt trite even as I said them, but I couldn't think of anything else. Do, 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 do. I don't like footsteps, didn't it? That was weird. Um, it's the music. It's like doom, doom, but it just sounds like fucking footsteps. Uh, I've tried to figure out what just happened. Why didn't you get hit? Oh, right. I didn't actually put it together until a little bit ago. So it's funny, because I noticed when we were doing that, she's like, what the hell just happened? And then she's like, why didn't you get hit, though? And I was like, huh, that one's an obvious. It's going to jump to right there. All right. Just needed to click three things to get written in blood. Boop, 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 boop. I wonder what happens if you don't get them right. You know what I mean? Kind of want to just, just kind of want to skip back and be like, don't like get it wrong and see what happens. Does it make you do it again? Like, I mean, we did it wrong once, but we skipped back to redo it. So, I don't know. I think it's cool you want to, but I, I don't really play games. Oh, right, of course. Maybe we could hang out somewhere. Uh, no, never mind. It's okay. Sorry for being weird. So yeah, and this is basically where he's like, I'm not going to bother to tell you that I love you. And because he's like, oh, yeah, you're not interested in my hobby or you don't even want to take an interest in my hobby. And you know what? He's got the right idea. So like if you were like that and you were like, oh, I'm totally into. Hold on. My favorite. What's wrong with you? all your stupid demands, so I think it's high time you swallowed one of ours. If we get out of here alive, you let our friends and the hostages go. We clear? <laughs> Scary. Um, I mean, he's got the right idea, so if he was like, oh, hey, hey, I got this game and I'm really interested, I mean, you could be like, okay, I'm not really good at playing games, but I'll try. Cool, sounds like fun. You know? If you're really not into playing games and somebody wants to play games and you're not into it, but he's kind of has the right idea 
You know what I mean? Like, if you're like, if you're like, oh, I really like to play it with you or whatever. And she's like, I mean, like, maybe we could do something else. Cause I'm like, not into games and like weird. And he's like, oh, yeah, never mind. That's his whole fucking life. It's his only fucking hobby. It's not like it's a hobby where you're like, hey, I'd love to go camping with you. And you're like, yeah, I'm not into camping. You go do that. Where it's like, oh, okay. You're not interested in this one hobby. He only has one. So, like, for us to be like, yeah, no! I can understand him being like, yeah, no, I guess maybe I shouldn't date this girl. Right. Totally, totally with you, bro. I don't blame the bad ending for that. You know what I mean? Like, you can't really blame him or blame us for getting a bad ending when we're like, yeah, nah, your only hobby I'm not into. Again, you have a bunch of hobbies, right? I play video games. I like to read. I craft like, like whatever. And I like movies. I like binge watching TV shows. I mean, I have very simple hobbies, but like if I were me meeting a person and they were like, I'm totally into like hiking and camping and like all that like naturey shit, I'd be like, yeah, no, this ain't gonna work because I'm not into any of that shit. But if like, oh, they're totally into camping and I'm totally into something else, but we have a bunch of other stuff in common or other things we could do together, cool. And then they just want to go camping with their friends. Peace out, bye, have fun. You don't have to share every hobby. But when you literally have just one, you, you kind of expect that person to get like invested in that hobby or like just interested or at least humor you a little even if she's like I hate video games or I'm not really good at games but yeah I'll try it out sure it'll be fun you know maybe we could get you out of video games and play board games it's still a type of game and we could play that together you know what I mean something anyway I sat down on the floor all of my energy had left me and we did it we saved everyone Kota nodded yeah we did I kept my promise to you. Huh? He smiled at me, but why is he looking away? It's probably the end of the... Even as I tried to form the words to ask, I realized that all the exertion had taken its toll, and I was quickly falling asleep. My eyes fluttered shut, and the last thing I heard was the excited mumbles of voices. Okay! And the doctor will be making his rounds soon, so make sure you're ready to see him. All right. After I'd passed out in the park, I'd been taken to the hospital. That was three days ago. Uncle Keiji had come by to visit and said that the rest of my friends had tried to take down Hogstein. But he'd been too tired to tell me everything, and everybody else was still recovering, so I hadn't heard all the details yet. I needed to recover, too. There'd be enough time to hear everyone's stories later. I looked over at the bed next to mine. The sheets were perfectly made, flat and crisp. Kota should have been there, but it was empty. Oh, God. It had been empty when I'd woken up, and I'd had to wait for the morning nurse to tell me what had happened. He told me to give you these, she'd said, and handed me a small package. Inside was a playbox jump and a letter. Oh, my God! You helped me confront my past. I never could have done that alone, and I appreciate what you did probably more than you know. Uh, but I still don't have the courage to face the world. Or you. I'm sorry. Goodbye. Kota Meoshi. That was all it said. Whatever we'd had, that small piece of paper was the end of it. That's harsh. I kind of, like... You know what? I lied. This still hurts. <laughs> I don't like these endings. These bad endings are great. Because they're painful. They're like, Ow! I mean, I get it. Like, we were like, yeah, no, I'm not interested in playing games, yo. So I could understand him being like, yeah, you know, she's not interested in my stuff. But then it'd be like, oh, okay, so we just, we're in the hospital and oh, and we're just pals and maybe nothing happens. But there's always like some kind of, they rip your heart out. I mean, granted, our choices led us here. But like, with Toa, it was like, oh, yeah, I know I said I love you, but like, I'm busy, yo, bye. Don't call me again because I'll get in trouble. And, like, he changes his number and shit. <laughs> I don't remember that. I don't remember what. But it was like, oh, he's like, yeah, could you, like, lose my number maybe? That'd be cool. I'm like, what a douche! It hurts so bad. Why? You know? And this, you're like, oh. It makes me so sad for the poor little shut-in. <laughs> like, I don't know. I don't like the bad endings, man. Uh, I'm never going to see him again, again, am I? When he decided this, I want. When did he decide this, I wondered. I thought, well, what I thought didn't matter anymore. It's all right, we'll move on. He won't, but... 
I flipped the power switch on the PBJ. It greeted me with a cheerful bing and the words new game flashed on the screen. I checked, but there were no saved games. He'd reset everything, even though he was so close to beating it. I looked at his note again, now uh, folded neatly next to me, but I couldn't remember the words perfectly. Oh, but I could remember the words perfectly, and my heart sank. It's not fun if we can't play it together. Then maybe you should have said that, instead of telling him you wanted to do something other than play games, Spacey. <laughs> Uh, look. Look, no bad ending is gonna make me cry like fucking Toa in Seven Scarlet, okay? Like, nothing. I don't care what these do when you're like, oh, I feel a little teary-eyed? A little teary there, wow. Um, look, I have teared up. Oh, I forgot which game it was, but I was like, okay, I got a little teary, like, oh. I got a little misty. But I have never actually bawled, and I will never bawl again. I reserve that for precious Toa. Not this Toa, other Toa. I reserve that for him. He is precious. He earned, he worked real hard to earn that spot. And no one will take that away. <laughs> oh. The menu music filled the quiet hospital room. I felt hot tears trickle from my eyes as I lay on the bed, very alone. Wow, that was... Way shorter than I thought it would be. Holy shit, that was... <laughs> Fuck. Okay. That was... This is even a 15 minute part. I feel... I feel really bad that... This is that short of a part. Well, well this will make us feel better. Um. Oh shit. There we go. No, wait, 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 where'd my things go? Oh, okay, I hit the wrong button. I put my, I dropped my controller, so. Um. I, his bad ending was bad, like, it's sad. But I don't think it was as bad as Toa's bad ending. Like, Toa's bad ending was like, oh! Because, again, we kissed Mayoshi, right? So, this happened. And then we're like, oh, so if he doesn't reciprocate our feelings, it's like, oh, okay, I guess I misread that and that kind of sucks, but, you know, you get over it. It's not like the Toa situation where he was like, I love you. And you're like, yeah, I, I mean, I love you too. And he's like, maybe, could you maybe tell me if you love me? And you're like, oh, okay, I'll think about it. And then like, you're like, yeah, no, I love you. And then he's like, oh, hey, you, right, you're calling me. Could you like not? And you're like, the fuck? Like that was, <laughs> that was some douche level trolling. You're like, oh. You son of a bitch. But, uh, yeah. So, like, Mayoshi's bad ending is sad, but it's not as bad. <laughs> it's more bad because you're like, we did this to ourselves. We didn't do anything to Toa but love him. And he just threw us away because he's a celebrity and he's a jerk. And, like, Mayoshi's bad ending, you're like, it's because we told him we didn't want to play games with him and we broke his little gamer heart. <laughs> like, we didn't want to be involved in his only hobby. It's literally his identity. Like, uh, but uh, yeah. So this isn't even a fifteen-minute part. So that's lovely. Um, it's the way it is, though. Uh, I. It makes me feel bad. I almost want to put up like part, whatever that was. This is 15 and this is 16. I almost want to put them up on the same day. I mean, like, part 15 and then an hour later, here's part 16. Because I just feel bad that that one was a 20-minute part because I rambled for so long. And the only reason this is going to be, like, 15 minutes is because I rambled quite a bit. This literally would have taken five minutes. And, like, but I don't really want to put the bad endings. I mean... I don't want to put the bad endings at the same part as the good endings. Unless you guys tell me, of course, by the time this goes up, I might have already recorded our next route. God damn it. Stop skipping. Um, I may have already recorded the next one because I'm a little bit ahead, but I need to stay as far ahead as possible just because, well, right now, oh God, this is going to go up in December. Yeah. Um, for Christmas coming up, you know, I got a time off, so I'm not going to be able to record a lot. So I need to get ahead and make sure everything's done so I don't not coming back from 
Christmas being behind. So I gotta stay on the motherfucking ball and like keep ahead. Plus this one's really easy to record. I literally have recorded all of Mayoshi's part in the same fucking day. <laughs> like I had a day off from work. So like I was like, I'll record some of it. And I was like, I just recorded the whole fucking thing. <laughs> like, like it, it was too easy. Like this game is a little bit too easy. There's some where you're like, I love this game, but it's just too much. Like, there's something about it when you're reading it. You're like, I mean, even this one in the very beginning, like, it's so good. But there's parts where you're like, okay, now we've just kind of hit a lull where I'm like, I need a break. This was just so much easy. This one was just very easy to record. Um, But, yeah, so, anyway. Or it's just because I took a long break from it. So I was, like, really excited to get back to it and find out some of the mystery. I don't know. I don't know what it is. But, um, but yeah. I just feel like maybe it's this game, like most of it, I've had moments, but like most of it is pretty easy to like record a couple hours at a time. Just be like, okay, I got like Sunday, just sit here and record and be like, fuck, do I have to stop? I don't want to. And there are other games where you record and you're like, all right, I know I could record another part, but like, I don't want an hour was like so long. Like, cause it just feel, it takes a lot out of you to record that hour. But, um, but yeah, I don't know. I mean, we could always just, put the good and the bad endings together but I don't I don't know if we should if we should just be like okay so I'm gonna record the good ending yay and then we end on the bad ending and then a CG or if we just okay we're about to get our good ending I'm gonna save let's go get our bad ending and then do the good ending you know what I mean um I like keeping them in two different parts but then we have two very short parts I, I think with Mayoshi it was just a matter of timing because chapter six was a lot shorter than I thought it would be um but I figured I figured we'd have it, it this was a part longer than I was anticipating but I think that's because I ramble a lot and I go off on tangents we know this this is what we do um so yeah so we probably could have maybe made some of the other parts a little bit longer and then maybe that last part would have fit in, but whatever. Um, yeah, but this, this was never going to be long. Skipping through that chapter and then like the little two minute bad ending. So I don't know. Well, now it's going to be like 18 minutes because I talked for so long. See, I can make it work. <laughs> I still feel bad, but anyway, so I think what we are doing when we come back in the next part, I think is, oh, it's Mirashi next. All right, cool. I wasn't sure. So, yep. Awesome. I thought Urabe was next. I was kind of excited about that. But I'm actually excited about Mirodashi. He's not my typical Otome guy. He's not my typical love interest. He's not usually the one I go for. But I like his character a lot, so I think it's going to be interesting. Um, so I think we'll have fun in his route, because he's a fun character. Anytime he's been around, he's been pretty fun. So, um... Yeah. So, uh, yeah, anyway. Uh, I will see you guys next time. Remember to give the video a big thumbs up and subscribe to see more.